Ron Harris here from Muscular Development with the pro maker George Farah. George, uh, who you got going into the Arnold Classic this weekend? First, I want to say what's up, MD. How's everybody doing? And uh, I have a bunch of people, actually. I have uh, the return of the Dominican Republic. <laughs> yeah. You know, Victor actually looking really good. I'm very happy that he started working with me since Spain, you know. Uh, he's gonna he's gonna show people a different package on Victor. We never see him that big. Yeah. You know, and uh, he's he's. I mean, very. I'm very happy with what we did. You know, and uh, of course, Branch Warren is back on my team. Yeah. Uh, everybody, you know, I love it when people, you know, <laughs> wrote this guy off. Yeah, yeah. Let me tell you some. When this guy walk on the stage, yeah. you're gonna you're gonna see something they never seen. So he looks amazing. I'm very happy. Uh, I have uh, Freddie Small, Freddie Big Small, yeah. uh, the best entertainer. He's gonna be good. Uh, I have a Brandon Curry. You know, uh, he didn't he didn't really look the way I want him for Olympia after we won together the Arnold the Brazil. But I think right here he's shredded. Uh, he's on. I have in the 212 Lucas. You know, he's another one like never been that shredded. So I'm happy. You know, I have Antitone and a woman figure. She's in her best you know time ever. So. Uh, you know, overall, I'm busy, but yeah, something I love doing, man, and it's, uh, I tell you what, I'm excited, man, to see Team MD kicking butt, you know. Speaking of Team MD, you know, we have a few of the people that are favored to win the show. Obviously, we got Dennis Wolf, we got Branch, the two-time champion, Victor's won this before, so, you know, depending on how this all shakes out, we could we could see any of these guys staying in the winner's circle. Absolutely. I mean, Saturday night. Yeah, absolutely. Those The guys you mentioned, they are going to be like, you know, in that first call out. And like I said, it's going to be depending on, you know, what flavor they like, you know, that night. Uh, I mean, you get the symmetrical, you know, uh, Sean Roden. You got the symmetrical Victor Martinez. Uh, you get the, the wow factor of uh, Dennis Wolf. And then you get the monster branch warren so you know what i'm saying overall it's gonna be it's gonna be really cool man i'm i'm looking like uh, forward to it because it's exciting this is the first time we have a show like you know you don't know right away who's gonna be the winner you know what i'm saying yeah. so it's it's really cool it's it's gonna be exciting for everybody last question for you you know i've seen you uh, i've sat next to you at shows and you know you get very animated you're very very emotionally invested in your clients you know, you really care where they win or lose. So is it a stressful thing for you to watch these judging and wonder what's going through the judging's mind, judge's mind as you see the call-outs and wondering what's going on? Well, you know, I mean, you know, sometimes uh, you, you, you're you a little biased, but then when you sit back and you're looking, you know, 9 out of 10, the judges are making the right calls. You know what I'm saying? So they're not going to take somebody who's going to be first and put them in 10th place. It's not going to happen. Not in, in IFBB. I mean, we know these all-season judges. They know what they're doing. And I respect every decision so far they make. You know what I'm saying? And even sometimes it's unexplainable. But then when you sit back and think about it, you know, you're like, wow, you know, that's why, you know, they did that. So you can't you can't disagree with them. They've been doing a phenomenal job. You know, I mean, we've been like family all these years. And, uh, yeah, I mean, of course, you get emotionally involved. Uh, those the people, you, you know, you're like you, you're prepping. It's kind of you, you live through them, you know, because everybody know I was, I only have one kidney, blah, 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 so I couldn't get big. But then, you know, taking these guys and make them as big as possible and make them, you know, shred as possible. And you kind of live through them. And, and, you know, if anything goes wrong, you get more stress. I mean, I used to compete and never get that stress. You know, but now now with these guys, I start shaking, eating my nails and stuff, you know. So it, it's, yeah, it is stressful. Well, I would definitely say that's the mark of a good coach. Then you care when you care that much that you're letting it physically affect you that much. So I think I think if I was your client, I'd be pretty happy to know that you are that emotionally invested in whether I won or lost. So, yeah. good. All right, for Team MD, George Farrow, Ron Harris. Mm -mm.